Okay, so things are looking great here. Uh, the sky is pretty much clear. Uh, it'll be good enough to uh, see the partial solar eclipse uh, that's happening. It, uh, um, it It is an annular eclipse, but from my location here in Kitchener, Ontario, Canada, we're only going to see a uh, partial solar eclipse. So that's good though. Um, I'm uh, looking forward to that. Um, it is about 20 after 5 in the morning and uh, the sun will be up in uh, less than an hour and it'll be uh, in this location here for me and as you can see there's some there's a few clouds but uh, i'm not worried about that at all we'll be able to get a view of the uh, partial solar eclipse so i'm going to get things set up and uh, take some photos and maybe some video and uh, hopefully uh, everything stays clear okay so for this shoot i'm going to be using my canon uh, 90d dslr and I've got the um, Ascar FMA 180 40mm triplet attached to it. And I've also got a solar filter that I've attached to it. Uh, just to, you know, safety reasons, of course. Uh, you always want to use a solar filter when we're looking at the sun. And um, right now, uh, things are still clear. It's looking good. Um, the sky is actually clearing in that area where the sun is going to be up and I can see hints of the sun already so we're getting close uh, I'm gonna just uh, wait it out grab a coffee and uh, then we'll get shooting uh, some photos and uh, check out the uh, partial solar eclipse so this here is the uh, Ascar FMA 180 um, it's a 40 millimeter diameter lens and uh, triplet design uh, comes with a flat field reducer uh, so everything is nice and sharp um, you can adjust focus here as you need to it connects uh, very easily to a DSLR as you can see and um, I've been uh, using this lens um, for wildlife uh, photos um, and I took some photos of the moon as well which uh, turned out uh, really nice um, it's a nice little little lens uh, it doesn't cost a lot and uh, something uh, to add to the arsenal that I think uh, works really well.